Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve if you're noticing that the services at a glance page in the Windows Security section in the Modern UI Settings page is blank or the Update and Security section is blank altogether. So this should hopefully be a fairly straightforward tutorial, guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So there's going to be a few commands in the description of the video we're going to be referencing. So you want to make sure you have my video up. And then you want to go ahead and open up the start menu. Type in CMD. Best results should come back with command prompt. You want to go ahead and right click on that and select run as administrator. If you receive the user account control prompt, you want to go ahead and select yes. Okay, so now that the command prompt is open, I'm going to have two commands for this section of the video. I want you guys to copy each one one at a time. They're both REGSVR32 commands, and we're going to copy the first one into our clipboard. So I just highlight over it, right click and copy, or use the Control C keyboard combination, and then go up to the top part of the command prompt here, right click on it, select edit, and then select paste to paste it in. Should say it has succeeded. Do the same thing for the second command here. Again, we're going to just go ahead and paste that in. Once that's done, go ahead and close it here. Restart your computer and see if that has resolved the problem. Another thing we can go ahead and try here would be to go ahead and open up the start menu. Type in troubleshoot. Best results should come back with troubleshoot settings. Go ahead and left click on that. Select additional troubleshooters on the right panel. And then underneath get up and running, select Windows Update, resolves problems that prevent you from updating Windows, and go ahead and select run the troubleshooter. Okay, so hopefully I would have been able to resolve the problem. Then you can go ahead and check for updates. One further thing we can try here, it would be to run a system file checker utility scan. So in order to do that, you just would open up the start menu, type in CMD, best results should come back with command prompt. You want to go ahead and right click on that and select run as administrator. If you receive the user account control prompt, go ahead and select yes. And now into this elevated command line window, you want to type in SFC followed by a space forward slash scan now. Scan now should all be one word attached to that forward slash out front. Hit enter on your keyboard to begin the system scan. This will take some time to run, so please be patient.
Okay, so it says that it's found corrupt files and successfully repaired them. Would suggest you guys close out of here, restart your computer, and that should be about it at this point. So, as always, thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial. Do that I was able to help you out. And I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.